Hey, I'm Jacob Soberoff. Welcome to our series, Investigate Fortitude, where we dive deeper into the science behind the show, Fortitude on Pivot. I'm joined by disease ecologist and president of EcoHealth Alliance, Dr. Peter Daszak. And tonight, we're going to be discussing parasites. Dr. Daszak, thank you again for joining me. All right, so let's watch this clip of Vincent discovering what the mystery is hiding deep beneath Margaret's skin. Here it is. Okie dokie. So that, that's a good stopping place, I think. Um, Dr. Daszak, wasps seem to be hatching out of Margaret's body. Is that, is that what you see also? It's a truly disgusting sight, but, <laughs> it, but it is not fiction. There are, it's not. There are insects that will burrow into our skin, pupate, and hatch out as, as living flies. So the bot fly. Um, if you travel to the tropics, you've got a good chance of getting infected with a fly that lays its eggs in your skin. The, the maggot grows just beneath the surface, eats your tissue. It, it's incredibly painful. You can't pluck them out, and it becomes really almost unbearable, and then it pupates and hatches out. What's your favorite? Do you have a favorite? I do have a, I have a couple of favorites. So there's one a very well-known one that um, it, it's, it creates a long worm, a white worm that lives in your lymph vessels. <laughs> to get it out of your body, you have to wind it out on a matchstick. The worm sticks its, its uh, end through your skin, you attach it to a matchstick, and over a period of a few days, you have to wind it out oh my. and pull it out. So what, what conditions would need to be present, just so I can avoid them, in, in order for what happened to Margaret to occur in real life? Um, you pick them up from walking barefoot in the forest, picking them up through the soil. You get attacked by an insect. You may not notice it. It lays an egg. Um, there are simple things you can do to stop that, but it does happen. It's common. I know people who've been infected with these things. Is there one that we should be most terrified by? I think the one that we should be most terrified by is the unknown. It's the next new big disease that's going to emerge and cause a pandemic. There are plenty of diseases out there we've never come across yet. We need to get out there and find out what they are and stop them before they happen. Be honest, does this kind of make you want to look into wasps that might have come out of mammoths? I'm really interested in this. It's a, <laughs> it's a beautiful scene. See, I knew it. Thank you again so much for being here. My pleasure. You can join the conversation on Twitter about tonight's episode using hashtag Fortitude. And to learn more and to take part in the solutions around these issues, go to investigatefortitude.com where we are posting actions, more videos, and articles about these topics. Big thank you to Dr. Dashik for joining me again tonight, along with everyone at EcoHealth Alliance. Be sure to watch Fortitude on Pivot with new episodes every Thursday at 10 p.m.